Hi guys, Robbie 46 here, and welcome yourselves to Monster Energy Supercross 2. Now, I know what you guys might be thinking, but Robbo, you didn't even play the first one. Well, that is correct, and there is a good reason why I didn't play the first one. And that is uh, mainly because I played MXGP3, and then not long after that came out, um, Monster Energy Supercross, the first game came out, and it basically just looked like MXGP3, but in arenas effectively so i kind of gave the first one a miss um mxgp pro came out the following year and i gave that a miss so i thought i'm gonna give this one a go this time and uh, see how we get on with it so yeah we are here with monster energy supercross 2 and don't worry for those of you who uh, might be worried that i'm gonna stop making ride 3 videos that is not gonna be the case at all um, I will continue making Ride 3 videos, so don't you worry about that. That is not going to stop, but at least we've got another series to get on with as well. I am actually going to do the tutorial. Uh, I'm expecting it to be pretty much very similar to MXGP, so I kind of got to get used to the, the handling and that again. Um, I haven't played MXGP3 for such a long time. So yeah, uh, LB clutch, R accelerate, that's what I expected. So yeah, we're gonna have a little play on this, see how we get on. Um, so here we go. Oh, what's going on? Oh, okay. Yeah, I know how to brake. So brake is, uh, is what I thought it was gonna be. I think all the controls are pretty much going to be exactly what we used to um, from MXGP3. So I'm not that experienced with motocross games or supercross games. Um, as you've just seen there, just gone straight into some barriers, but never mind. Um, yeah, my spe speciality is uh, short circuit racing and um, the MotoGP and the Ride Series. And uh, yeah, MXGP3 was uh, pretty much the first and only motocross game that I've bought and actually played. I played the demo for uh, MXGP2, but uh, yeah, I thought I'd give this one a go and uh, see how we get on. I did unfortunately end up getting bored with MXGP3. I'm hoping that's not going to be the case, but oh shit, okay. <laughs> um, yeah, I just it just got really, really easy, even on the hardest difficulty. The AI were really easy to beat, and I kind of lost interest in it. So I'm hoping it's going to be a bit more difficult this time round. Just got to get really used to it again. Feel so rusty coming into this, and yeah, well, <laughs> get out of the way. All right, what's going on? Okay, so telling you how to do scrubs. It's just uh, trying to get used to the feel and everything after uh, playing Ride 3 for a long time, MOGP 18 before that, obviously Ride 2, Ride 1 and all the others and um, yeah, nice to mix it up a little bit, obviously you guys will have a completely new series to watch as well. Now I'm not going to start career mode in this video, um, I'll start that in an completely new video this is purely just my first play and first impressions of the game um, so far um, I'm not doing a good enough job to uh, keep on the road but um, yeah first person oh okay All right, okay so we've got to follow that blue line go goggle vision if you want but prefer third person just because then at least I can see what the bike is actually doing handling I think it feels well very similar to MXGP3 from what I can remember like I said I haven't played MXGP3 in such a long time so it will take me a while to get used to this kind of game again but hopefully we'll get there um, yeah, it feels alright. Feels alright at the moment. Um, not really got to a point where I'm, I'm taking decent lines or anything, but that will hopefully come. Just want to see if I can change. No, I was going to see if I could change the um, to manual gears, but 
don't appear to be able to do that so we'll just continue with automatic for now but as soon as we get the chance to change to manual gears I'll definitely change it to manual and uh, put everything on the hardest difficulty and when we start career mode um, I basically use all the settings that I use in the other milestone games where hardest difficulty all the assists off rewind I'll turn off as well because I, I don't like using rewind so it could turn into quite a decent series, um, providing the AI are competitive. And hopefully they're they're not the complete opposite and uh, stupidly impossible to beat. But we'll find out in due course. I will check out the compound in a second as well. Once we're done with this tutorial, I will go and check out the compound and um, yeah, have a little explore around there. I think this compound is meant to be bigger than what it was in MXGP3. So, yeah, we're going to have a, a little little look at it and see what's about. It definitely feels a bit more slidey, if that's the right word, than uh, MXGP3. I think um, one of the main complaints with MX MXGP3 was it was like really, really grippy a lot of the time. So it definitely feels like you're on a loose surface on a Monster Energy Supercross 2. That's a bit of a mouthful to say every time, isn't it? Okay. Okay, so you can actually do celebrations when you go over the uh, the last jump, over the finish line. Um, that's something that wasn't in MXGP3. I don't know if it's in a MXGP Pro because, like I said, I didn't play that, but showtime. Yeah, I literally done nothing. <laughs> okay, well, it's just something we'll have to get used to. But so far, so good at the moment. Um, apart from my god awful playing, um, yeah. So we're gonna go to the compound now and see what we can uh, do and check it out. So go with the. F uh, I think we'll go with the 450. Um, I have created a a rider but I'm gonna show you guys that when we start career mode um, so, ah, here we go now we can change all the settings so that can be on realistic that can be an advanced uh, turn that off manual manual off uh, what's that oh that's that uh, blue line thing so I think we can turn that off as well okay so looking good Let's head over to the compound. See so yeah, how we get on just exploring the place. Now, I will, like I do with all my videos, cut the loading out if uh, it's too long. And then we can get right into the action and get back with it. So here we go. Compound free roaming. So let's go see what we can do. So here we go. Press completely the wrong button straight away and look behind me. So used to that button being a uh, tuck in on uh, like the ride games. Whoa, okay. There's a lot of jumps about, which is good. Oh, wow, this is just like a a big playground that you can. Oh, okay. Crash at apparently. <laughs> You get like little points as well for doing th certain things. Oh, that! I don't know how we didn't come off there and just hit that the bucket off that bloody bulldozer. There's a ramp there. Should we try and go off the ramp? Try and turn around, and then oh, put the rear brake on and kick the ass end up. Right, let's try and go over that ramp. Where is it? There it is. Okay. Wow. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> When I meant hit the ramp, I didn't mean with my face. I meant with the bike. Okay, well, there's a yeah, there's a lot of jumps in there. At least it's a good place to come and practice as well, which is obviously oh shit, which is uh what you're pretty much meant to do with the compound, just practice. So you can practice doing the scrubs and stuff like that. And just practice uh, getting used to the, the ha overall handling of the game. Um, ready for when we start career mode. 
Like I said, do not worry. I will still continue with ride three. I will not be stopping that at all. But we are... Well, you guys are going to have two different series to be able to watch, which is good for you guys. All variety. Variety is the spice of life, as they say. Both milestone games, though, obviously. Oh, Christ, it doesn't sound very good when you have it in the wrong gear trying to uh, pull away. Right, let's try this thing. Okay, that felt alright. There's another jump there. And there's another loop thing here. Well, screwed that up. Screwed that up completely. Let's try and go a bit faster around. No. Okay, let's not try and go around a bit faster then. Oh. Okay, right. Let's try and uh, get the scrubs now. Oh, shit. Okay, I thought that was going all the way then. Okay, you can go through the fences. That's fine. I just want to do a bit more exploring. Just see what's about. Let's follow this path for a minute. Oh, uh, there's some things there. Some ramps. Let's go up here. What's about? Lots of trees, lots of things to crash into. Right, let's try and find... Oh, what's over there? That looks like a couple of flags. Oh, okay. Where are we? Where are... Oh, hang on. I don't think we can... Can we go in here? No, we can't go in here yet. Okay, we're not a high enough level. Okay. So some of it is uh, locked away, but that's fine because uh, obviously the more you progress, the more you're going to be able to unlock and the more stuff you're going to be able to do on the compound. Right, let's try and do this jump. Oh, oh I think we may have just been able to get on that, that second part, but we uh, weren't in line with it. A bit more exploring. What's down here? There's another cornered off area which we can't go into. Oh, straight into a post. That's great. <laughs> Have all the things to crash into. Oh, there's trees around here. There's a few barns. Oh, hang on. That barn was open. That barn had its door open. Can we go inside? Let's have a little look. Yes, we can. We can go inside. Oh, there's a ramp there. There is a ramp. Okay. Well, let's turn around and see if we can go up that ramp inside. <laughs> Try and go up inside the building. Come on. Hopefully a farmer won't come out with his shotgun in a minute. Hooligans on his motocross bikes. Oh. Oh, crap. Oh no, I'm stuck. I can't use the throttle. Wow, okay. I'm legit stuck right now. My throttle ain't working. Alright, gonna have to try and wiggle off here. Are we not meant to go up there? Oh, there we go. Throttle's back. Come on, come on, come on. Oh! <laughs> right, let's try and go up there again. Let's try and go up there a little bit quicker. Surely you can go up there. It's just weird that the throttle just stopped working. Let's try and do a... Yeah, you can do a burnout and a half donut. Right, okay, let's try and, get and go up the ramp. And try and get up a bit quicker. Come on, come on. Oh, too quick. <laughs> okay, well, let's forget about that for now. Do a bit more exploring. So the compound is a big old area. There is a lot of things you can do. I don't know if we get to do any races around here at any point or anything. Okay, you can't do stoppies. Oh, well, there we go. Here's a map. Oh, we can uh, start single event. Or start time attack. Oh, we're... <sighs> 
We haven't progressed enough to be able to do any. Okay. Well, it gives you like a layout of the different tracks in the the compound. Okay. All right. Let's hit this jump. We. Oh, that's not going to land. Nope. <laughs> Completely face planted. Try to see if I could get it to go all the way around. Can we go in the river? We can go in the river. Nice. I was half expecting it just to respawn me back out as soon as I went in there, but it's not too deep. Hopefully we won't kill the engine. Oh! I just want to use a free camera, but I've just hit a rock. Are we going to land? Yes, we are. Let's get out of it. That's a nice little jump by the looks of it. Try and get a nice jump. And uh, try and get the free camera on it in the air if we can. Yeah, that would do. Free camera. I don't know if we're going to land this, but looks pretty sweet. I'll do for the thumbnail for the video. Okay. We're not going to land it. No. Oh, I just hit the corner. That would have been painful. Right. I think um, that is pretty much it for this video, guys. So I will be starting career mode in the next video. So, yeah, that is the start of uh, Monster Energy Supercross 2. It's a... Uh, Seeming quite promising at the moment, but uh, I'll find out when we start career mode how it's going to be. But thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave this video a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel for more content. I'll just see you guys in the next video. See you.